Welcome to www.maryisthenewevangelization.com. My name is Tom, and I'd like to thank you for tuning in to this very special YouTube presentation on how well do you know the Blessed Mother? How close are you to the Blessed Mother? This is, <clears throat> this is an honest question, a very, very honest question. It's one thing to know about the Blessed Mother, but it's another thing to know the Blessed Mother. So the question is, do you know about the Blessed Mother or do you know the Blessed Mother? Does she know you? Do you spend time together? Do you hang out with each other? Do you talk to each other? Is she a personal friend? Is she a personal mother? Is she, you know, a personal mentor, teacher, lover? Is she in your life that deeply, that intimately? Okay? Um, all you have to do is listen to the message at Guadalupe. Know for certain, least of my sons, that I am the perfect and perpetual Virgin Mary. I am your merciful mother. For all those who put their trust in her, have confidence in her, she will comfort them in their affliction. She will heal their wounds. She is our merciful mother. So, we have to be, we can't afford not to be close to her. She is the oil. She is the oil that Jesus said to the virgins, don't run out of oil, okay? Mary is the oil, brothers and sisters. So, how well do you know the Blessed Mother? How well do you know the Blessed Mother? Do you know that she has appeared to people on this earth in every century since the time of her son, Jesus Christ? Mexico, France, Egypt, Russia, Ukraine, America, Yugoslavia, Portugal. Okay? So... Some people would say she's a time traveler. She is there every generation. She's also the woman of Revelation chapter 12. I don't know how many people I argued with. No, that's the church. No, that's Israel. Um, guess what, guys? One greater than Israel is here. Okay? One greater than the church is here. I don't understand, you know, why it doesn't get through. So anyway, how well do you know the Blessed Mother? That is the huge question. Revelation 12 talks about those under her mantle of protection will be protected. Guess what, guys? If you have any sense of the news and what's going on in the world, we're going to need some protection. She's here to protect us supernaturally. So... Um, she wants us to love one another, okay? not oppose one another. We're not supposed to want to burn heretics at the stake. You know, we're not supposed to want to execute people who don't believe exactly the same things that we believe. Jesus never did that. Mary never did that. Okay? The important thing is faith in Jesus Christ and love of your neighbor that is the that is what it's all about guys so we are in the fulfillment of revelation right now make sure i mean everyone's got to know revelation 12 by this point you should know it inside and out now it's time to look at revelation 17 18 19 20 the fall of babylon the mother of all prostitutes the fall of babylon is upon us so 
uh, it's going to be interesting, but there's no way that you can be outside of her protection. Jesus is telling us, take cover, guys, take cover under my mother, under your mother, under our lady, take cover. Orders from Christ, from Jesus Christ himself, take cover. So, if you don't take cover, and you want to just go around talking about things, and you want to hurt people, and put people down, and criticize, and judge, um, you're still under Eve, basically. You're choosing Eve. You're, you're, you're choosing the old woman. Whereas God wants us to choose the new woman, the new Eve, our merciful mother, the bride of Christ, and under her mantle, we're the bride of Christ, because we're under her mantle, we're all the bride of Christ, but she is the bride of Christ. So, <clears throat> anyway, thanks for tuning in. Spread the message, spread the love, and learn this prayer. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. It's called the Hail Holy Queen. Okay? She's our queen. It's okay to honor her. Jesus wants us to honor her. And the more you honor her, the better you're going to love Jesus. Trust me, because he honored her. So you're being more Christ-like to honor his mother. Okay, thank you. God bless you. Russia, pray for the conversion of Russia. She chose Russia. It's her chosen land. Okay, God bless you.